It's a solidarity rally to mobilize support for the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, al Haji Atiku Abubakar. The mammoth crowd marched across the Ibadan metropolis from the Agodi Gate area to the Asian Makbu Hall, where they were received by party leaders. Addressing the crowd, leaders of the PDP described Atiku Abubakar as the most qualified to reposition Nigeria to the path of social economic development. Our leader, Atiku Abubakar, who is going to be our next president, would be here at the Mapo Hall on the 23rd of this month, hopefully. Uh, we would pray for him and I am optimistic he would be victorious at the polls. One thing I'm confident of is that of all the presidential candidates, none of them has the experience, the knowledge and capacity to pilot the affairs of Nigeria like Atiku Abubakar. Atiku was our former vice president and I'm confident he will perform. The Yoruba land used to be the cradle for qualitative knowledge and education, and that's no longer the situation. But when Atiku becomes president, things will change for better and for good. Worried about the antics of the G5 governors who are opposed to the continued stay of the PDP national chairman Iyo Chayu, former Minister of State for the FCT, Jumoke Akinjide, urged the electorate to reject any other candidate other than Atiku Abubakar. Atiku Abubakar said when he is president, we will have electric power, we will have education, we will have water, we will become the first country in Africa and the leader of the world. Nigeria is supposed to lead the black world all over the, the world. Leadership of the People's Democratic Party in Oyo State are split between the party presidential candidate and the state governor, Shei Makinde, who is opposed to Atiku Abubakar.